what is up guys it's so bash welcome back and i want to say this game right here has kept me busy for almost the past 24 hours before anything else this is dungeon crash it's a new side scroll rpg but it's got so much more to it uh before we do get into it guys i want to let you know this is a sponsored video there will be a sponsored link in the description below downloading it does help us out here at Soulbash gaming so i thank you if you do download this game i want to say it's awesome Look at all this stuff you have to begin with on just your main page. All right, once you level up some, you're gonna unlock some of this stuff like the Magic Lab, Training Lab, Arena. And these are your little huts that you have to build. You have to build buildings. You start out with a little shanty and then you can build better stuff and you have to manage this stuff. These are where your heroes live that you collect when you play this game. Very unique. I've not really seen something like this. And you can keep expanding. The more you go, the more you can have and looking into the heroes you have a lineup of when you start out i believe it's five that you can have and then once you level up a good bit you can get six right now i have i think six and i went and farmed quite a good bit of the epic ones and i want to try to open up a chest there are some new ones that i want to try to get so we're going to open up some chests for them all right, so go back over right to the beginning where you start out at right here you have the tavern this is going to let us basically try to get some new heroes and what i want to do uh we have it looks like an expert summon so we have a chance of getting another epic hero maybe so let's see what we can get now the art style for this game is very unique i like it and the play style is very unique as well so we have one more of these so let's try again okay we got another blue didn't get any epics that's okay but these are other things that you can use and let me back out of this one and let's try to get an epic out of this okay we've got 14 so i'm gonna do it 10 times i've never done it 10 times let's get an epic we got an epic we got a merlin soul nice now i already have merlin so i'm not sure what it's gonna do there yet but we will find out we got a free daily summons as well so all these people are heroes that you're going to be using and you're going to have to put them in little houses but the cool thing about this is look you just swipe down guys and your kingdom is on top of a dungeon now i'm going to collect this stuff for each guy you have you can attack another place and it's just ongoing it goes deeper and deeper different ones uh they each have like a certain kind of element to it it looks like but i have not figured out what it would what it is the dragon here it's got a store in it when you collect it now you can attack him again that takes an hour to do but you're getting you're collecting stuff off of this so it's always good to have this stuff running you can upgrade gear you can uh change out legends it's just so much you can do now the next one's ten, gonna cost 10,000 and 159 stars. Do I have 159? Unlocking Dungeon 9 needs 159 courage stars. Would you like to collect an instances? Okay, so we're gonna have to go fight to undo that. And this is what the battles look like in this game. All right, we've completed through that, so I have not been here yet. Now it does cost stamina to fight, but guys, I literally almost sat here and played this game for the whole day yesterday like if I, I i had to make myself stop playing it or i wasn't gonna get anything done and i did work on some stuff yesterday i didn't put a video out i'm working on another project as well so look forward to me giving some, some more information about that pretty soon and that was on auto it automatically goes through so i'll take you through a dungeon take auto off that way we can kind of see exactly what you have to actually do uh, you don't unlock auto until like level 18 or something like that so you get to enjoy the game and actually play it and learn the basics of it so we're going to turn auto off and two times off these things you see popping out they're going down to either a healer an attack guy or a mage type and once you get enough of them you get an ability that you can use and once you use that ability you have to collect them again to use them and every so often the actual heroes have abilities of their own that they can use so you're going to want to balance either healer types, uh, magicians, or tank types. You can delegate which ones go there by changing up your lineup. Now, it doesn't have to be any kind of specific set thing. You can do two attacks, two heals, two mages, 
or you could swap it up have three one heal and two mages it's just all in how you want to play the game it does have pb pvp as well so let's go back out and we're going to scroll over to the arena and i believe i have not done any today so we're going to check out the arena i'm ranked 765 i got down this game is so rewarding guys i have not spent anything and look i've got over 3,000 diamonds and just so much more you can get by completing stuff daily that's why the longer you played it just the more stuff you get now let's see we can attack one of these guys 186 so this is gonna this should be a pretty close fight right here all right these are done automatically you don't have to do anything but this is the i guess the arena in this game i got three tanks out front one healer and two mages so let's see how this plays out uh, we're kind of even they done took just about one of my tanks down he is getting some heals and he's really close to dying they took out all three tanks right there wow those mages are pretty strong so it's down to my healer and two mages and it doesn't look too good for me that was a really close fight gonna take that guy out possibly nah he's not gonna make it gonna freeze that guy's got some really strong mages so it's a good makeup uh, but really close fight really cool game and let's see it records the matches as you can see I played a lot last night and won quite a few ranked up I ranked up really quick and you do get diamonds from that but my number one favorite thing about this game is look at the top left corner you see VIP one I've not spent a dime on this game okay cool thing about this is when you spend gems you actually gain VIP points so you do go up in VIP level you do not have to pay for it that's really cool um, very few games you see this in it has so many quests that you can do you get gold and experience outside of doing dungeons as well and there's a whole quest line of stuff that, that you can get by accomplishing things and there's dailies as well uh, these guys right here these will pop up randomly and they either give you stuff if you have any points left so it's they're called visitors and let's check down here I believe we did start this no we didn't so we needed some more there so we'll we will have to go back but check this out yesterday there's a thing over here called guardian right and it gave me this egg and it's a red dragon egg and it says it's ready now it takes 24 hours to for this thing to hatch I'm assuming but check that out we got a dragon now can we level him up or anything like that we can let's level this guy up a good bit I'm not sure how high we can level him up I'm just gonna spam this button right here the stronger this little dude is hopefully he's gonna be helping me out that might change some things for uh, these fights that I'm having but it's really nice it kind of leads you along it shows you how to do all of this stuff and once you get used to playing you know you're gonna be getting gear as you go gear is gonna be the hardest thing to get to begin with and I'm still down on a couple pieces on one of my last look characters that still don't have a few pieces of gear so and I'm 37 38 somewhere in there so it's it's a progressing style game I really like it I like what they've done the art style is nice the detail of having to pay attention to what characters you use and what kind of spells they have to beat some of this stuff is really nice as well so we've leveled this guy up to level 32 already and it's still going this is insane we've dumped like almost 300 of these things in here and it just gives you so much to put back into the game it's nice you don't really ever have to go looking for something to do there's always something to do all right we maxed him out nice he's level 37 now at 38 we unlock another thing for him and this is where you can i guess control his stuff but did he go into the lineup i'm not sure let's take a look here that was not the lineup there we go that's the lineup and at level 38 we can use this guardian so we need to hit level 38 i'm going to try to run some dungeons real quick and i will be right back and we'll look at this thing now this is one i will show you guys this is a three stage fight now as you can see things start popping out i'm going to collect them 
And instead of just one short quick fight for an adventure mode, this is gonna have three. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and heal. That way I can try to stay on top of things. She's gonna have another heal ready as soon as I come out. So I'm gonna use this guy's ability. He's gonna do a good bit of damage. We're gonna heal up again. All right. And I've not been paying attention and collecting too much stuff. As you can see, it turns kind of gray there and just goes away. Now he's really low on health already. So we're gonna have to push this really hard to be able to take this boss out without dying. If you, all of your heroes survive, you do not lose any stars, so you can three star it. Now this is gonna be really close. We're gonna have to use a good bit of skill trying to beat this guy, but I don't really think my first tank is gonna hold out. I think we're gonna only two star this one. Uh, we've actually, I've, that's, I've run into a part where I actually have to Pay attention to what's being cast and used. Uh, he's barely halfway dead. We don't have a healer now. Our healer is down. That is not good. We're about to lose our tank. We lost our tank. All right, let's see if we can't finish this guy off at least and complete it. We should be able to. Yes, here we go. He is dead. But that is what a normal three stage fight looks like they do get quite difficult so you're gonna have to check your lineups and level stuff up and be consistent in the game to actually progress i mean this is only chapter six i mean i'm a good ways into the game but it's really challenging and it's still a really fun game to play now back into this and i'll be right back after we hit uh, level 38 and here we go we should hit level 38 right here and we do awesome we can level our guys up we completed a quest so let's collect this stuff real quick and let's check out this uh well and then collect there there we go let's check out this lineup with this guardian thing now, this is going to be really interesting this may help me out quite a bit we're going to add him to the lineup and that is amazing we have a dragon to go help us now so let's check out this right here nice lots of goodies it's like i said this game is super rewarding look at all this stuff i'm getting just for doing stuff in the game that you're supposed to do it's really amazing how much stuff they give you now this is another three stage fight i believe so it's going to be interesting to see if this dragon thing helps out anything any way whatsoever and you can see him in the bag right there i've got it on auto and they're just blazing through this stuff. Check him out. Let's. Whoa! That was awesome. Okay, so yeah. The, the dragon's gonna help out a good bit. That was pretty awesome. That's gonna make things a good bit easier because that stage two is usually where you lost a good bit of your health. Now, this is cool. They do have a lot of cutscenes in between fights. You can skip them if you want to. But let's see how this thing plays out with a dragon involved. Wow! that was too easy so guys get to level 38 and get your dragon and get him hatched as soon as possible because this guy is freaking awesome i want to thank you guys so much for watching if you have any questions about this game feel free to ask them like i said earlier this is a sponsored video so there is a link in the description where you can download this game at it is on ios and android i want to thank you guys again for watching as always like comment and subscribe i am soul bash you guys have a nice day